Hey guys, Untold Truth about Kendamic here, and sorry about the two little orange charts. I just up to a new iOS 14 beta tester, so that's why it has that. It means it's screen recording. Anyways, this is the Kendamic. Uh, 24 hours living at McDonald's, self or stealth camping video. Let's get it. Well, there it is. My home for the next 24 hours. Now, Ken, did you ever think that camping out at McDonald's is kind of weird, man? What do you think the police would think of you? S middle, uh, an old man, or well, middle-aged man, staying at the McDonald's of camera and flying his drone illegally over in private property, and here's you holding a camera while driving for the drive through it's just still a traffic law and felony, even when you're in the drive-thru. It doesn't matter that you don't seem to give a shit about anything, because you think you can, that you're above everything, and yet you're going out during the pandemic when you can easily go and have the food delivered to you for skip the dishes. People only come here that have they come from work, not a bunch of a YouTuber like you. It makes. Five thousand dollars a month, like you, and then you say, "Sorry, but I just came into that." Seeing that, you, but like I said, it's a movie that you barely get by. You do get by easily. You just beg for the people's money all the time. You just honest dumbass. So stop begging for people's money all the time, Kendomic. Hours. Today we are going to be doing something I've never tried before. Living at McDonald's for... Oh, eating at McDonald's for 24 hours and then you never tried before. This is another video that you saw from Dean Drops or someone else. And it's probably one of the stupidest ones you've ever done. To be honest, Ken and I. 24 hours straight. I will eat, sleep at McDonald's, and I'm going to live at McDonald's. Straight up, bitch. So what she says today, I don't have the big... Big and Big Mac on the menu, but she'll put bacon on the Big Mac and then Ken on his Big Mac. Because they have bacon for the other products. But Ken's just like, isn't the same thing? Bacon and Big Mac. I'm Ken Dummick. And I make false copyright claims. Yes, please. Yeah, uh, we'll do Coke, please. Yeah. Yes, please. On my Big Mac. And that's all I thought a bacon Big Mac was. It is. It's just, you just don't have it on the menu. It came and went. It was a limited time menu. It's on the menu for a limited time. It came and went. But you can put bacon on your Big Mac anytime, you dumb idiot. It didn't really make it into a bacon Big Mac. It's just a big, big Mac of bacon on it. I haven't just seen the commercial. So let me know in the comments below. <laughs> What's the difference between a bacon Big Mac and a Big Mac with bacon? Go ahead and see that trademark logo. Look at the little R there. That means that the logo belongs to McDonald's for the copyright infringement law, which you can easily be sued by one day for stealing the trademark logos and putting them in your own videos, which is illegal, Ken Domic. Also trying to figure out a very good strategic place. The first meal parked that I eat. Oh, there's me. Oh, there's not Boring me. shit, boring shit. Because they it's put it on, get our drink ready to go. Something. This out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He seems to be somewhat. All done. Baby, all done. Baby, all done. Baby all done, baby all done, baby all done, baby all done, baby all done. It's now 12 minutes after 6. We got a lot. 23 hours left, Ken. Night snack. I think they on. Tonight? No one cares about how you're going to camp out in your car. Peep, it's a food channel. You're turning this thing into your candomic scene living channel. Here with our sleeping bag. Here, like I've seen some other people in their YouTube videos. Uh, so I looked at my car 
earlier on and the tinted windows seem to be pretty good. I just won't be able to have a light on in here. Um, Please don't tell me that you're going to change in your car when you have a spare clothes. I mean, I guess you can't go inside the McDonald's, but, oh man, just wear the same clothes and change when you get home. Like, what is, is tinted windows when it gets to go up to the glass? It's, ugh. Without drawing suspicion to myself, uh, and I also have this like little bit of a black out one, uh, blanket that I'm gonna pu be putting up there. I'll definitely be closing this. <coughs> oh, Ken Namek, is that you? Uh, just to make sure that I get some privacy there. Not that. Do a little walk through and uh, grab some <coughs> and a junior chicken, please. Thank you. Like I'm wearing a mask now. Finally, about damn time. The only reason why you're wearing a mask now is because it's mandatory where you live. Where you live. And you have to follow by the rule. Because you probably got caught not wearing a mask and you got in trouble for it. So now Mr. Ken Alec has to wear a mask. Which you should have been doing three, four fucking months ago. I'm wearing a mask when this virus started and staying at home. And not going out and showing that you just don't give a shit about what's going on. You don't know how much people, like, you don't know how many people have died. You know, more over 500,000 people have died from the coronavirus all over the world. And yet, just, you're just showing that you don't give a care about anybody. Because you think you're above everybody, above it all. And you're not going to get the virus. You can easily get the virus. You can be asymptomatic. And carrying the virus. Do not, but Mr. Ken Namek just doesn't care. Because he just wants to get his video views done. And a junior chicken, please? Thank you. Thank you, sir. Do you guys close the door at a certain time? or yeah, it's like 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock, okay. Junior, it costs between Outweighs the McChicken. So you compare the difference between the junior chicken and the McChicken. You could see the difference. What you done four fucking times before? Did you explain to us four fucking times before? We get what the damn shit is. Stop it, Cameron. Stop. Junior chicken. Sorry. Junior chicken. Sorry. See you at twelve. Yeah, you see, we'll see us at 12, but then you'll be back here at 11, like not even 11.30. Not a proven fact that you lie to your subscribers about what you do. <laughs> Seriously. Well, guys, as you can see, it is almost 11.30 at night, and I'm trying to figure out what the best little snack would be before bedtime, and I'm thinking. Nothing, a salad, a salad. The six pack of McNuggets. Of course, you add shove your face full of more fast food. And then you're gonna say, oh, I'm going a 24 hour or 48 hour fast. Yeah, bullshit. You're not fasting at all. And you think you're 204 pounds. Yeah, I, yeah, I believe that. Wink, wink. With one yeah, I believe that when pigs fly. Thing of honey, and that should put me into lullaby land. No, it should put you into open search, uh, heart sack land, and open surgery, open heart surgery land. If you keep on eating McDonald's like this or fast food like this, I keep eat fast food four times a week. That's not healthy, dude. Like. Ugh. Here at McDonald's, just north of Newmarket. I'm hoping the lighting's okay. I know it's gonna be a little bit weird, but let's hit this one right here. This guy just made it. It's funny, nobody's been here for a while. There's some light for you. And then I'll get to be fine. Thing. There's the guy they would like really acknowledge here. Benching is killing me. All right, people, let's park it. All right, got our nuggets. Move that up, show you that. One honey is perfect. I'm trying to make this video too long, but I don't want to make yeah. it too short. 
one honey. Fat freaking lot. Fat. All right, time. I actually like to mix the honey and the sweet and sour together. That was really nice. All done? Baby, all done. Baby, all done. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Baby can't make. Go to sleep. Baby is all done. It's time for baby Ken to go to sleep. Go to sleep, baby Ken Garmick. Go to sleep, go to sleep, baby Ken Garmick. Time for bed. All right, time to close the blast shields. There we go. I call them moon roofs and sun roofs, you dumbass. Sky dome closure prevent some of the light from coming in. It is pretty bright in this parking lot. Cops just pulled in too. They're getting some food. Yeah, they're coming to arrest you. Food. So they'll hold them for a bit. Uh, so let's get in the back. I'm gonna have to hide some of the stuff so people can see that in the front. And I'll put my little shield up and uh, should be good to go. I'm shooting this with my iPhone. I think it's just better for the lighting conditions I have. So I noticed I set my bed up on this side of the, of the car. I'm gonna have to move it to this side of the car because the light is coming through from that light. It's coming straight into this side. Uh, oops, those are my lights. Let me turn them back on. Hope this lighting is okay. It's quite warm in the car, so I'm not gonna get out the sleeping bag camera uh, two. So, good morning. Baby, I'll done. Baby, I'll wake. Oh my gosh. It was a rough night, man. Like, look how much of an old rough man Ken looks night. like. Trucks. It started getting cold around 3 or 4 in the morning. Get cold. 21 degrees overnight, you said. That's not cold, you dumb idiot. So I had to break this out, get out the sleeping bag, and then of course now it's morning traffic. Just, it's 5.41, it will so pretty much give it away. Uh. You see your old fat ass, give your old car, I can't not make, already our face focus when I can tissue one or take tissue one. KDRC, can you put uh, correct me in the comments below if I'm saying the name of the car right or in the live chat or for premiere. Man emerges from car. Six o'clock in the morning. No shoes. We'll quickly put on our shoes and go Gross. grab some gr Another way is spreading the virus. I mean, shoes that touch your feet that it can also spread the virus for a person that has. We'd have to clean the floor. At least you didn't go inside McDonald's like that. Grub! Do we really need to see an angle or a camera angle of you putting on your shoes? Of course, Ken Dummy thinks this is gold, gold footage. M more. Even more illegal. Illegal. Dr drone sh footage on private property. Which is also not allowed. Can I mix at McDonald's? Which looks like a and W, I think. And Dollarama. Pet smart and pet value. Okay, do I see you know what's behind my here? Tell me how much of the restaurants I actually got right. Places. Arcade deep deep cannot like dissemination expose eggs and I you said you used to live around here. Alright, good morning people. We are now all awake. I do have a change of clothes that I will be putting on a little bit later on. Right now I just want to eat some food. Uh, I'm definitely gonna be doing the egg mac more fattening food. Muffin. Why don't you do that? My number one thing. Hi there, can I help you? Good morning. Could I please have an egg McMuffin meal, please? Uh, with sure, a medium coffee to drink? 
Yes, please. Just and double double. Just black. Okay. And um, I'm gonna do the flapjacks, please. With. McDonald's doesn't have flapjacks. They have pancakes, you idiot. Pancakes? Pancakes, of course. Uh, with a milk and an orange juice. So you're getting, holy, holy shit, man, pank, uh, English muffin, pef, a uh, breakfast sandwich, a hash brown, a coffee, pancakes, uh, orange juice, and a milk, wow. And then I'm going to say, oh, this is a healthy d d choice, not when you add that much shit to your thing, that's not healthy. I wish there's some of the stuff that McDonald's has. Yes, it's delicious, but it's not good for you. No thanks. So just one hot cake and one medium orange juice and a milk? Yes, please. 1750 for breakfast. I am ordering for two people. But I had to have both. Just for you and just for you. How's that sun for you? Right, Coming through? Oh, isn't it nice? Okay, now I'm just going back to it. Just for you and just for you. And here's two cameras. Shoot. You can see the other old, old piece of crap cameras he used to stall. Like the second one's kind of blurry and out of focus. As you can tell. <laughs> it's coming through. I'm excited, people. Big day ahead of us. Big day. Dave, oh. what can I do for you? Weather yeah, report, mad. stock prices, shopping list, lights on, lights off. Can't even know what we were doing this minimum skip ads. What does this can have that I don't? Plus, you got some nice well, fun nails. Rainbow gives you wings. It's, it's not as busy as last night. It's great fun I'm loving it. Milk, coffee, perfect. Really Thank you. You too. Yeah, we're getting close to them. Like, loving it. Look how much, look how close you lean. Milk, Just, coffee, oh, steering wheel tray. Can you stop doing this every time? Steering wheel tray, steering wheel tray. We start eating and you set the spin it. You have routines like, well, actually, I actually don't want to say something like that because I don't want to offend people. You have routines like a kid would. Like, seriously, like, you know, shtick and everything. Really, man? Do you have to do this? Like, stop biting this. No one's gonna buy that stupid steering wheel tray. I know Paul from Critical is Japan bought one. He's cool. But he doesn't bug and say, oh, let's get a steering wheel tray and start eating every damn video. Like you do. Like, you're so desperate to make money. Not everyone's gonna buy one. And you just, yeah, you flash, you do live streams and say that you're in quarantine and beg for money. When people are not making much money right now, and you whine about how you're not able to go on trips because of the coronavirus, and yet you don't even give a care about what's going on, you can get less of a share. You go without a mask into up until now, but now you have to be mandatory where you live. But before, you didn't even give a damn what was going on. And don't say you did, because you don't. You just don't give a shit. Do you not know how much people died? Over 500,000 again. It makes me pissed off that you just are being like this. Why don't you just review some frozen dinners for a while? If you, if you have true fans, they'll still stick up your channel if you're not doing fast food. Because they know what's going on. Look at healthy junk food. They're not going out right now. They're staying at home and making cool recipes. And she said they went to 2 million subscribers in Ireland. They're getting almost at 3 million. They're doing great. First thing in the morning and start eating. Look at that. Steal the march. Ugh. I am not a big fan of McDonald's pancakes. They're good if you like them, but it's. Yeah. Oh, we got the M on this side. We got whipped butter. And we're going to sterilize our hands real quick. All right, guys, here is our extreme close up of our. What did I say? Can't remember your extreme close up. I hate your extreme close up. Let's look at that pile of 
unhealthy food. Now, yes, I like the English muffin, or the egg muffin. It's delicious. It's hash brown. Good. But do I, you know? Do I eat fast food a lot? Like every four, every four times a week? No, I have it maybe once or twice a month. Sometimes more, but I try not to. Only in times where I, where we don't feel like cooking. Like I normally, I'd be working in a nursing home. I still do live with my parents, but um. Anyway, guys, that's not our business to talk about here. But um, it's hard to make money right now, and you feel you waving it on our face, you idiot. Candomic, really? Again? Super nutritious double breakfast. We got our McCafe coffee over here. Our orange juice, freshly poured. We got a milk with our pancakes. We got our beautiful egg McMuffin. I would say this is one of the best things that McDonald's has ever created besides the Big Mac. And then we got those tasty hash browns. And that would be the Big Mac today, be some size Big Mac, I guess. The pancakes so much very appetizing and look dry. Maybe the candle will complain about it later. I wouldn't be surprised. Those pancakes, flapjack. And I noticed what's like, I'm saying that someone see if can complain about it later. Max, whatever you want to call them. Hot. They're, they're called pancakes, you idiot. Not flapjacks, dumbass. Cakes, are you ready to go? Let's do it. So I brought my own knife and fork. I actually forgot like a regular knife, but uh, my buddy gave me this thing. It's from Cold Four, Cold Four, GED and it's a fully knife and it's FDA approved or whatever so you can actually bring it on a plane if you want but it's my own little knife let's put on our butter I don't think you'd be able to put it on a plane Ken they would, they would take that away from you at the security thing you would not be able to bring it on a plane you'd pick up on the machine and you would probably get stopped and get in a lot of shit. All right. Oh, it's nice and soft. We want to have one syrup, and this is the kind of pancakes that like absorbs. Oh, maybe not. This this syrup is super thick. Yeah, that's good. Ugh, Yummy. I don't that's think that's going to absorb right now, anytime soon into those hot cakes. Check that. They're pancakes, you idiot. Out. Oh, isn't that lovely? All right, that's enough. That's enough for now. Just in case we need it for later. I guess but first, thing. let's quickly eat that. They make us dumb mm. stupid videos. I don't know why I always say quickly. Take your time. Can not make us eat McDonald's hash browns like a thousand fucking mother fucking times? Like we get it. Are they to are they golden brown? Savory, fresh. Huh? Is it pandemic? Let's see. Tell us. I'm interested. <gasps> Enjoy it. I'm not sure who came up with hash browns like this first out of all the fast food places. I'm thinking it's McDonald's. Correct me if I'm wrong. But they're. Uh, I think you're wrong there. They're definitely one of the best hash browns on the market. Let's take a bite. I want this, but sometimes I'll put some pepper. Mmm, coffee. Okay, more. Speed. Yep, the blast doors. Favorite breakfast item. Okay. So good. It is now almost 6:30 in the morning. A lot, but I think I'm alright about this one. Mmm. So good. It is now. Baby, all done. Baby, all done. I know I didn't say all done, but baby, all done. 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 Well, Ken, you have... Congratulations, Ken. You have 12 hours to go in your challenge now. Can you make it? I think not. Now, almost 6.30 in the morning. 
Uh, I am going to finish off my juice, then sit back, relax, finish off my coffee, use their facilities, because I'm going to need that, and uh, clean up, freshen up, put a new shirt on, do some people watching, and then have lunch. Did you just say do some people watching? So you gotta... do you, you idiot, you peeping Tom. You know, watching people. Like, that sounds so wrong. That sounds like you're being a peeping Tom. Ken. Went back in uh, to use the facilities once again. As you can possibly imagine, maybe, living at McDonald's for 24 there. hours, you might have to go to the washroom once in a while. I'm gonna let you leave this back. Quake, can you can tell us when he has to go take a piss? Or shit. Please send him your money. He'll tell you when he needs to go to the bathroom. Back windows open, because it is, again, crazy hot. Let's check out this latte. Cheers. It's black coffee, it's not a latte again. Trying to kill some time <laughs> before lunch. But I walked around a bunch of times. I've already put, uh, I think, 2,000 steps in already. Oh, bull crap. Excuse me. I'm tired of this shit. Bullshit. You put in 2,400 steps. So I just keep walking around the perimeter of the, the restaurant. This is good. I don't know how many calories in a latte, probably a lot. A lot of latte calories. But uh, yeah, if you want to lose weight, just drink black coffee. That is what you're drinking, you idiot. And you should put someone that's losing weight. Like, look at that big fat guy. You say you're fasting, but I think not. Why don't you skip and step on the scale and show us? <laughs> It's now just before 12, I want to get in there before... Already? Before 12, I want to get in there before the crowds start possibly showing up, and then we'll hit the drive through for dinner. Let's go in there, use their order board, and uh, get our lunch. Come back here. Go in there and touch your uh, order board. Are you going to go in there wearing gloves? No? Are you going to wear a mask? Well, yes, because you have to now, because it's mandatory. They should do that, but... You probably go touch it later. I hope you wash your hands, but you probably won't you touch your face till. Idiot. Here, need it with you. Let's go. And that mask again is running. He made a joke in his latest vlog. Did you see by the fisting it? Like, he didn't touch it. It's a plural by tapping his car. I mean, as long as you don't bring the camera inside, I can't the show. Let's all close it off. This is gold footage. This is entertaining. Ken doesn't care about what's going on right now. There's a worldwide bam pandemic going on. And you're gonna cry like, oh well, my plans are ruined. I can't go on any of these trips. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too. Alright, guys, let's eat. Uh, hold up, guys. Like I said, Ken never knows where we're doing the SMEs. His ads on Skip Alright guys, we are back in the car. Gotta take off the face mask. I got this face mask when I uh, gave blood at the blood clinic. Donating blood. It's yeah, but check your blood to make sure you're safe. You don't have anything bad in your blood. You should get tested before you give away your blood. You could have something bad, like AIDS or something. Just, or something could be bad in your blood. Just saying, before you give your blood to people that are, are sick. Like, what if, you, what if you had contacted or something, and then you give your blood to someone else, and then, and then they got even more sick. It's a good thing. I got three bonus fries. Yeah, when they stuck them with a the needle, gr gravy didn't pour out. Whoops, let's sanitize. 
Yeah, they stick it in your gravy, did pearl, and all this. And candy fell out. And when they cut your loaf, candy will fall out. And shit. Candy and burgers and fries and stuff. That was funny. Ken Dummick just wrote a joke for this channel. Sanitize. Again, don't do that over your food. As you would have saw by me ordering on the board, I got the BLT grilled chicken sandwich for eleven forty nine for the whole meal. And you put uh, ice cream straight up the center. First time I've had one of these. And you know what, McDonald's, you know what you got to do? Is do the, uh, what was it called? Uh, the iceberg. So you, you I think you put uh, ice cream straight up the center. And, and that would cost a lot of money. It probably cost at least five dollars. Or six dollars. And they had a, you would complain about the price. You suggest this shit all the time. Just like you did in, in the KDRC video I have. Where you suggested that they make a, put egg, a sausage, and beef, and the chicken patty McGriddle, or Mc, 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 McMuffin. Like, not much people want to eat spicy chicken for breakfast. You can get chicken waffles, but a chicken McGriddle with pancakes, that's disgusting. And then slot blue slush all around, and it looks like it's uh, an iceberg, and uh, some of those uh, ice cream trucks sell those. You gotta get on that, it'll be like a dessert thing. Just add another buck or something, I don't know. But that's a good idea. Free from me to you. They're not gonna listen to you, McDonald's. Please, whatever you do, do not listen to this idiot. He does not make good ideas. Got some fries, hot. Nice and hot. The tomato. Watching lots of videos. Holy cow. Woo! That's a steamer. Basically got six hours to go. Playing lots of games on my on my phone. Watching lots of videos. It's a little bit hot. Good sandwich. Blue slushy. I don't want to know how much sugar's in that. I don't want to know. Yeah, it's not I bet it's a lot. You. But who cares? It's shoot day. What happens when you say that same thing and you have open heart surgery? Who cares? It's only open heart surgery. It's only a little heart attack. Like, seriously, man. I can eat whatever I want on shoot day. My favorite thing about this job is shoot day. And eating whatever I want. And spilling whatever I want. Last four fries. Mm hmm. Now we just have to wait for six hours. Me a bunch of times. I'm at. One. Oh, it tastes so good. So I'm just gonna sit back. It's on. Ah, uh, sorry, crispy. Yes. And. Woohoo! That's why I keep eating these fries. More fries, of course. Because they are perfect. Perfect French fries. Way to go, McDonald's. Now you're happy. I want to do a standalone video, video coming up. You complain about McDonald's. On the McCafe little McDonald's. donuts. And he said they're good about them. Just. Ugh. Again, let me know in the comments below. Do you want to see that soon or later? It's up to you. We don't care, kid. I'll do all the donuts in one review. I thought I'd order something. I haven't ordered. Of course, you'll do all the donuts in one review, you fat pig. Ordered in decades. I honestly don't remember the last time I ever ordered a vanilla milkshake. So, cheers to you. Which milkshake flavor do you like uh, at McDonald's? It says triple thick, and they're correct. It's tri triple thick. Compared to get that up the straw. No surprise you didn't. Add one of your ulu laugh moments right there. That's been very nostalgic for me. I'm enjoying that a lot. Again, if I stop eating these fries, then they're gonna go cold. So I'm not gonna stop. Two fisting it. It's funny, you get one that's like perfectly salted, and then one that's way too salty. There you go again, two fisting it. Like you did in that one. In that video of KDD, 
K-D-D-E. Excuse me. Which is gross. Like it. Ugh. It's disgusting when you eat your food. You do its food reviews. Those are like the little gems. Salty, sugary. Salty, sugary. Okay, which of the shit? Salty, sugary, salty, sugary. That's something a kid would do, Ken. Are you like six years old? Seriously. Repeat. Almost done. Done. Now on to our baby all done. 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 Quick wrap. And again, this is the chicken and pita. Very nice. It's a wrap on a pita. I just remember my dad used to love not soggy and flimsy. As you can see, it is six o'clock. Not soggy and flimsy. Last bite. Mm hmm. Good way to finish. Baby all done. Baby all done. Baby all done. The challenge. He actually made it. Mark the calendar. He actually did a 24 hour challenge. And he actually did it for 24 hours. How surprising. Finish off a 24 hour feast. As you can see, it is 6 o'clock p.m., 24 hours, hanging out at a McDonald's, living in the back of my car, eating nothing but McDonald's food, eating over. Alright, now let's get the vlog channel so you can see about the disgusting joke he made. Anyway, it's good. Saturday, uh, July 11th, and uh, the Canadian Blood Services gave me a call last night and said, if you're available on Saturday afternoon, <laughs> I have to wait 10 minutes. But this is... Yeah, maybe you shouldn't go in there filming them. It's a Canadian Blood... Even... Yeah, that's right. Maybe you shouldn't go in there filming them. They probably don't want you to bring your camera in there. Not everyone's cool if you filming everywhere, Ken. Now, Mike, like, what are you doing? Just turn off the camera, go donate blood, and fuck it off of the video camera shit. This is the place. Canadian Blood Services have been coming here for years. We had over 300 people at 120 uh, channel, which is awesome. Sure, I'll take this Stuff. Mm. Okay. This is worse than your BJ angle. Let's call this the the like the dildo camera angle. Have a good day. Thank you. Yeah, this is called the dildo camera angle. Or the penis camera angle. Gross. You just see, especially that. that. Okay. Wait, watch this. Have a good day. This example, why? Thank you. Wait right here. See that? He bent down like a little shake. You call that watching your hands spinning your little fingers? You put the camera down. BJ camera angle. And the dick, cam the dick camera angle. Ugh, that was just the worst one of yet. That's the snack cart. You can pick one. Surprise, Ken I didn't try to pick like a step one of each of them. Alright, we're all done. Got a new Baby all done. Baby all done. Baby all done, baby all done, baby all done. Subscriber out of it? <laughs> of course you had to brag because you got a new damn subscriber out of it. How are you filming them? The guy was asking me what uh, social medias I was posting to. And they wanted to know how many followers I had. We don't need to see that picture of you donating blood. Just say that you don't need blood, like it's ugh. And that intrigued them. All right. Let's go home. gonna make it some gross sex joke about the way that the, the, the mask looks like.
Wait, did you the door that? I recall. Did you guys see that? Let's go home. Watch, watch, watch. Bing. I heard that. He darting the car next to you. First up, let's have our cookies. So it's funny when she handed me these. What did that? What does that look like to you? Ooh la la. Yeah. Oh, really, get us? It's disgusting. You're referring to a female product, and saying so when it looked to you like, like to you, ooh la la. You're gross. At least it wasn't it. One of those gay jokes you did this time. As she was handing me those. <laughs> I'm like, oh boy. I need people like you? Alright, guys, this has been another untold truth about Ken Namik here. And in this part of the clip, we see that he's makes gross jokes. And we see in this video that he does illegal drone shots on that stupid 24 hour challenge he did. Hope you guys like this one. Sorry, I haven't been doing videos like this in a while. Just been really busy. Hope you enjoyed this one, and we'll see you in the next one. Untold Truth About Kentonomic, out.